What's up everybody? I'm back in record time. It's been like 10 days since the last update. But the boxes are piling high. And Rogue One stuff is flowing in. And it's time for some more unboxing action. So, uh, the first giant box I have right now. Um, this is from Entertainment Earth. I think I mentioned this in the last video. Can't recall exactly. Um, if I did or not, I think I did. But... So now this is a really cool thing. I got back up. This thing is too big. Um, cool thing about them is I pre-ordered this case ugh, literally on Black Friday. I hit the camera and spinning around here. Not on Black Friday. On Force Friday. Too many Fridays with names. Um, so I pre-ordered this on Force Friday. And I wanted to show you how these things come. It's actually pretty cool. So a wait a giant giant box with my invoice. Now I paid 135 for this, and then I found out on one of the Facebook groups that uh, if you email uh, Entertainment Earth and say that you found the product somewhere else cheaper, which I did, um, this case was, I paid 135 oh, you know what, huh. this isn't what I thought it was, but even better. So this was from Black Friday, not Force Friday. There's a giant pile of packaging trash behind me. Um, this is from Black Friday, not Force Friday. Again. Uh, oh, I got a cool extra thing. Probably that I don't care about. Alright, cool free thing that I didn't pay for. It's a uh, Star Trek Borg Sphere mini bobble ship. If anybody wants this, let me know. I'll, I'll send it to you. Because I don't like Star Trek that much. But anyways, Black Friday pickup is the Entertainment Earth Black Series 6 inch 4 pack of Sand Trooper with a white um, shoulder pad. I can't think of the actual order of those. Crimson Storm Trooper, um, which is obviously just a Red Storm Trooper. Uh, Lieutenant, I'm not even going to try that one. It's O-X-I-X-O. Oxio? I don't know. And R2Q5. So this is pretty cool. I don't like how this doesn't fold up like the uh, Amazon exclusives do, so I don't really know how I'm gonna display this. But that is something I will have to figure out soon. No, take it off camera for no reason. All right, so now the next box, which is the one I was talking about the whole time. It isn't the box that I thought it was. So anyways, back to the story, even though I don't remember where I left off, so I'm going to start it all over again. Pre-ordered this on Force Friday. Uh, $135. Found out that it was available at Big Bag Toy Store for $120. No fret, I just emailed the customer service with my order information and a link to their price. And the price matching. It they said it would be about seven days until I get the money back, but oh, by the way, box inside of a box, which is awesome. Um, so I'm getting it for the same price as they offered at Big Bag Toy Store, so I'm literally paid exactly $20 per figure, got free shipping. It's Black Series Wave 5. So I'm, it's, I don't understand how they do their, it's like Wave 5, 16, but this is, at least I really hope, this better be uh, Wave 9. Ooh, I, I never get case fresh figures. This is really fun. By the way, carbon fiber unboxing knife. I'm trying to avoid what I always find in stores, which is that razor mark across the edge of the figures. I don't want any of that to be happening here. Because I've hit the camera more times in this video than I have in years of doing videos. I don't know why, but they always put that one in backwards. But... Leia, at t Pilot, Obi-Wan, Sabine, Darth Revan, Snowtrooper. Everybody... So right now, I guess Revan, I haven't looked, but I've been reading that Darth Revan's going for like $80 on eBay. Um, so if you want them, 120 bucks to get the other five figures for, you know, extremely cheap compared to him. There 
There's Leia. Face still not as bad as we first saw, but still not great. But it's, it is what it is. I was really looking forward to this one, AT, -AT pilot. Yeah, he looks sweet. Obi Wan. I'm still gonna get the the uh, convention exclusive one with the table. They're on my list of what I need. Sabine, which I'm really liking the uh, the Rebels one. So we've got so far we've got Sabine, Kanan, Ahsoka. Hera's coming soon. Then we'll need Ezra. Maybe we'll get lucky and they throw us some of the, um, maybe a couple of Inquisitors. Darth Maul would be sweet. I would have you all over a Darth Maul. Darth Revan. He looks pretty sweet. Not gonna lie. That's a good looking figure right there. I'm not really a huge fan of having EU stuff released when we don't have, I don't know, Force Awakens Luke. Oh, that's, that's the Snowtrooper looks awesome. I really like how he has like the dirt, like the off-white kind of dirty look to him, just like they did in the movie. That's pretty sweet. And you would think that, what, 10 Black Series figures right there would be, uh... Oh, by the way, I don't know if I said, the uh, the four-pack in the back there, it's $100 normally. You can usually buy it for around 70 on their site, but on Black Friday, it was on sale for 50 with free shipping, so I bought it. Um, and I had free shipping on this case, too. Um, and then, it's not over yet. An eBay pickup that I got for like 10 bucks shipped. Green card R2. Uh, really kind of cool thing is it has the original KB Toys 4 dollars sticker on it. I'm just going to leave that on there. I'm 99% sure I could get it off, but I think it kind of gives it some character. And then today, I had to go to the store to get some stuff. Walmart to be specific on my way home from work. And I went down the hot toil, even though I have, oh, uh, I have all the, the only, well, basically I need the six inch black series, uh, Scarab exclusive that they have. Um, but I ran in and I only need one more three and three quarter inch, which I don't think I'm going to find anymore. But the old five peel away, Rogue One, I don't know how to see this his name yet, but Donnie Yen, I actually, I like. Even though these are only five POA, I, I, I keep myself carded so articulation doesn't like make it or break it for me. But even with five POA, like, these sculpts are pretty damn good, and the paint application is pretty good. He he looks really good. Um, I mean, Cassie and Andor, he looks okay. And then Ray Jakku, which I'm pretty sure is a recard. Ninety nine percent sure is a recard, but whatever. Completionist, so I'll take it. And. Vader on the Rogue One card. Um, sculpt looks pretty damn good. Can't really complain. So that's it. Um, hopefully I'll be doing a new video soon where I've got this to unroll. Um, spoiler alert has something to do with that and this. You can probably figure out what that is pretty easily. But that's it. I'm gonna put all this stuff away. Um, Within the next month, I'm, I'm going to probably have to do another pickup video because I'm just on a roll right now. Um, and I have four fig at least four figures in the mail that I can think of off the top of my head on the way. And then um, hopefully soon, um, a collection update video. And we'll see what else I can get going on here. Just watching. Be sure to like the video. Subscribe if you haven't already. I appreciate it.